This is a headline that you will likely never see. Not that it isn't true, but rather the facts of a prospering Earth just don't fit the media's narrative of a planet spiraling into climate doom owing to man-made warming. The fact that the Earth is thriving, prospering, and greening may be the most significant of all the inconvenient climate facts that we're exploring in this video series. So get ready to be amazed by how our planet is flourishing precisely due to rising temperature and increasing carbon dioxide. Increasing plant growth due to CO2 fertilization effect appears to be the primary driver of increases in vegetation for most of the Earth's non-arid areas. As we learned in earlier videos, it is well documented that higher levels of CO2 lead to increases in plant and crop growth. A recent study examined global vegetation increases and decreases using NASA satellite data for a 27-year period beginning in 1982. This figure and subsequent charts map the vegetation of the planet where increasing vegetation or greening is shown in green and areas of plant decrease are shown in red or brown. This study determined that during this 27-year period there was a persistent and widespread increase in vegetation of 25 to 50 percent of the vegetated area of the earth while less than four percent of the globe was experiencing decreasing vegetation or what they termed browning. A more recent study in 2018 examined similar data and again confirmed a significant global increase in plant growth. In this study the researchers focused on the greening of specific vegetation types they measured substantial vegetation increases across the globe's broadleaf forests, coniferous forests, evergreen forests, and grasslands. The average grassland increase is a remarkable 5% per year, which translates into an astounding increase of 85% over the 27-year period studied. Simply remarkable. Another driver in the greening of the earth is an increase in precipitation in formerly arid areas of the earth owing to an increase in temperature over the last several hundred years. This greening of formerly desert areas is the most visible and stunning element of the positive effects of climate change. These former desert or semi-desert areas have experienced a remarkable turnaround from near barren desert to, in some cases, lush grasslands. Likely, the most stunning turnaround is being played out today in the southern Sahara, in an area known as the Sahel, where the once barren desert is experiencing a remarkable transformation into green productive areas. Positive vegetation trends are occurring in many other arid parts of the world, including Australia, northern India, Turkey, and China, to name a few. Finally, our warming climate has allowed vegetation, including trees and shrubs, to reclaim formerly non-viable areas in the high latitudes and higher elevations, with tree line extending far to the north in the northern hemisphere. According to Dr. Tim Ball, the Canadian tree line has moved 200 kilometers northward over the last 200 years. The story of an earth that's thriving, prospering, and greening may well be the biggest untold story of our generation. That the earth isn't plunging into a climate catastrophe should be a banner front page headline for the New York Times, but you and I both know that will never occur. Instead, they'll continue to peddle the same stories of climate catastrophe based on failed climate models. Sleep well. Mother Earth's doing remarkably well.